In 1979, a silent plume drifted over a Soviet city and triggered the deadliest laboratory accident in human history. It happened in Sverdlovsk, inside a restricted military microbiology complex. A critical part of an air filtration system was not properly in place. A single failure that allowed airborne bacillus anthracis spores to escape the release was microscopic, but biologically devastating. People located directly downwind began developing the unmistakable signs of inhalational anthrax, a form so rare and severe that its progression is a medical emergency. Autopsy findings later revealed classic pathology, massive hemorrhagic mediastinitis, overwhelming toxemia, and tissue changes consistent with high-dose airborne exposure. At least 66 deaths were officially confirmed, but epidemiological reconstructions suggest the true count may have approached 100, making it the most fatal accidental biological release ever documented. For years, the incident was concealed under the explanation of contaminated meat. But after the fall of the Soviet Union, independent scientists examined case locations, wind patterns and outbreak timing, and the evidence pointed unmistakably to a laboratory containment breach. One misaligned filter, microscopic particles carried by the wind, and an outbreak that reshaped the world's understanding of biological safety and the consequences of a single point of failure.